Making the Pie Story and Art by Valerie Gorbachev All summer long, Bert, Beth, and Grandpa worked in their pumpkin patch. They pulled weeds and watered the plants. In the fall, they helped Grandpa pick the biggest pumpkin in the patch. Then they wheeled it to the house and got to work. It was time to make a pie. Bert stirred the spices into the pumpkin, and Beth rolled the pie crust. When the pie was ready, Grandpa put it into the oven. Grandpa, said Bert, may we invite our friends over to share our pie? Good idea, said Grandpa. Let's all have dinner together, too. So Bert and Beth called their friends. When their friends arrived, everybody sat down to eat. Then, after dinner, Grandpa served their homemade pumpkin pie. Delicious! Delicious! Cried all their friends. As everyone headed home, Beth cried, Next time, we'll make apple pie. Bert, Beth, and the Snowflakes. Story and Art by Valerie Gorbachev. Bert and Beth were happy when it snowed. They liked catching snowflakes. Look, Beth, cried Bert. I caught a snowflake. I wish we could keep them, said Beth. I do too, said Bert, but they melt so fast. Maybe Grandpa can help, said Beth. Grandpa, our snowflakes keep melting, said Beth. Come in, kids, said Grandpa. I have an idea. We can make our own snowflakes, said Grandpa. Our snowflakes are beautiful said Beth. And they won't melt, said Bert. Bert, Beth, and the Sandcastle. Story and Art by Valerie Gorbachev. Bert and Beth were having a great day at the beach. They played in the water. They ate lunch. And then they decided to make a sandcastle. Let's make a really big one this time, said Beth. When they had finished, Bert said, Grandpa, look, do you like our sandcastle? Wow, said Grandpa. That's the biggest one you've ever made. It looks like a real castle. He walked around the castle and then peeked in one of the windows. I would love to live there, said Grandpa. You can't live there, said Bert. Our castle is not big enough. But don't worry, Grandpa. Tomorrow, we will build a bigger one just for you said Beth. Bert, Beth, and Grandpa go skating. Story and Art by Valerie Gorbachev. One winter day, Grandpa took Bert and Beth ice skating. Watch me, Grandpa, said Bert. Watch me, Grandpa, said Beth. Uh-oh, said Bert. Watch out, Grandpa! Oh, dear, said Grandpa. Skating isn't easy. Don't worry, said Bert. We'll teach you. And they did. Let's pretend. Story and Art by Valerie Gorbachev. One day, Bert and Beth took their cars and trucks outside. Look, I'm making roads, 
said Bert. And these pine cones can be the houses, said Beth. Wow, said Bert. The ants like our roads too. Those ants are so small, said Beth. I bet they look at us and think we are giants. We are giants, said Bert. Let's pretend we're so big that we can see over the tops of the houses. We can walk through the river without getting our clothes wet, said Beth. And we're taller than all the trees in the forest, said Bert. When the giants got home, Grandpa said, Hi, little ones. What did you do today? We weren't little ones today. We were giants, said Beth. Then it sounds as if you're ready for some giant sandwiches, said Grandpa. Let's eat. Bert, Beth, and the Bedtime Story. Story and Art by Valerie Gorbachev. Read us a bedtime story, Grandpa, said Bert and Beth. So Grandpa read a story about a princess and a knight. Bert and Beth decided to act out the story. I'll be the princess, said Beth. I'll be the knight, said Bert. It's time for bed, said Grandpa. Sweet dreams, kids. And the princess and the knight went off to bed. Bert, Beth, and the Rocking Chair. Story and Art by Valerie Gorbachev. One day, Grandfather made a rocking chair for Bert and Beth. Bert rocked on the rocking chair. Beth rocked on the rocking chair. Then they both rocked on the rocking chair. Bert and Beth called their friends. They all had fun on the rocking chair. Until it broke. Don't cry, kids, said Grandfather. I'll make a new rocking chair for you and your friends. And he did. Bert, Beth, and the Open Sea. Story and Art by Valerie Gorbachev. One day, Grandfather gave Bert and Beth a beautiful sailboat. They decided to sail it in the bathtub. Let's pretend it's not the bathtub, said Bert. Let's pretend it's the open sea. Okay, said Beth. Let's pretend we run into a huge storm at sea, said Bert. That's scary, said Beth. And there are sharks all around us, said Bert. That's very scary said Beth. And there's a pirate ship, too, said Bert. Oh, no, said Beth. Don't be scared, Beth, said Bert. We're really just sailing our sailboat in the bathtub. Come play with us, Grandfather, said Beth. Now that Grandfather's here, I won't be scared at all. Bert and Beth Go Hiking. Story and Art by Valerie Gorbachev. One day, Bert, Beth, and Grandpa took a walk in the forest. Look, Grandpa, said Beth. I found some acorns. I see a bird's nest, said Bert. I love wading in the brook, said Beth. 
I love playing in the moss, said Bert. Look, said Beth. There's a picture of the acorns I found. And there's the bird's nest I saw, said Bert. We sure had fun on our hike in the forest, said Grandpa.